great right now. I was glad I was I was glad I was able to go and hit my routine and clean up my landings a lot more than the night before and have a lot of fun. And um, you had a really solid routine out there. Talk about during the routine what you were thinking about and like, what you felt like after you finished. I was just thinking about doing one thing at a time, not thinking ahead, just staying in the moment and just to remember to have fun. What did it feel like when you walked off? Um, your dad looked so excited. <laughs> you were grinning from ear to ear. Yeah, about it felt really good. I was just really happy that I think I did my best full routine ever and it was just a lot of fun. The scores were really tight. Yes. What did that feel like when it was just below? I was a little bummed but still really happy that I was a for my first world. I was able to do so well. Have you done enough to, to, to take it? Yeah. yeah. Did you compete the other day? Help today as well? Like, yeah, I, I think knowing just what to expect and how many people and what was going on really helped a lot. Out of all the finalists, who's your favorite routine to watch? I really liked Mai's routine. It was really cute, and she did really good. It's definitely a lot different than J.O., but it's, I think it's a lot more fun and like everyone's a lot more engaged and everyone out on the floor really supports each other and it's really fun. Would you have ever expected this uh, looking back last year at this time? I never would have thought I would have been here today, no. <laughs> but here I am, so. <laughs> Did you always want to be an elite or was... I never really thought about it too much until the opportunity came around and I just decided to go for it. And how did the opportunity come around? I went to the JO national team camp and they spotted me there and started asking me to come to the regular national team camps and then from then on I just kept going. How's it like having uh, your dad as your coach? You said before that it's great, but talk a little bit more about that. Yeah, it's really great just to have him out there, it feels a lot more comfortable and it's a lot of fun to be able to share these memories and experiences with him. What about the overall experience of being here with the girls, the team, the team as well? And how did that, how did, maybe just talk about how that was. Yeah, um, it's a lot of fun. Definitely having Ashton as like the most experienced and like the role model, it's helped a lot because she knows what to expect and she's done all of this before and she's really been helping keep us all together and have a lot of fun. Did anything surprise you about the world's experience in either the competition or outside or anything like that? Not really. The crowd is definitely a lot bigger than I'm used to. That was probably the most ex surprising. And did you, did you like the loud crowd and like the... the yeah, I, I like it a lot. It really helps to get me going. And going forward, you're um, committed to Oregon State. Yes. Right now, I'm just taking one year at a time and seeing how things go and decide from there. What are you most looking forward to about um, NCAA gymnastics? Definitely being with a, like a big team. That's definitely going to be really fun. Great job out there. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you.